What's up, Internet? I'm Gangsta Shrek, and today we're doing another car vlog. Today is Monday, whatever day it is, I don't know. Um, I shoot these the same day I, I upload them, so whatever, whatever day it is, it's today. It's, I, don't, I don't know, it's Monday, about 10 a.m. I'm heading to work. I'm on a different work schedule this week, so you've already seen these a little bit, a little bit sooner than usual. But, um, yeah, other than that, still be, still be doing the same upload schedule and all that fun stuff. I'll be doing a, live, a Twitch live stream tonight. Hopefully to finish Life is Strange. I'm hoping is to the dark turn. And if you, if you missed it, I, if you go on YouTube, all four, all, all four episodes are on my channel. So, hopefully they're good quality because I've been having issues, excuse me, uh, recording and live streams. It's been a pain trying to fix it. So last one went pretty good on Twitch. So hopefully it's better. But today, like usual, I'm gonna pull a pull game topic out of the magical hat that's over here. You know that I have over there. And I talk about it today. Today is going to be about violence in video games. And how, how people per perceive it to be that perceive violence in video games causes violence in real life. And like, like I said in the other one, other vlogs, I'm going to be utterly up, up front and blunt about it. Because I, I've heard this topic so many times. It's a, uh, the easy go-to topic to go to whenever, you know, violence, you know, someone robs a bank, oh yeah, they learn it from a game. That may be true, but it's the mentality. Okay, so that's start, I'll start from the beginning. I know Grand Theft Auto V is a big, big deal. Obviously, you know, you can rob banks, you can kill people. You can um, <clears throat> have sex with hookers. You can um, all all sorts of stuff. Now, clear back to PS One day, obviously. They have Grand Theft Auto. Also have the Mega Man games that you can rob, rob banks in. All that fun stuff. And all that fun stuff. I'm not saying I'm not saying, I'm not saying I, I can down rob banks and kill people. I'm not saying that. But people, you know, every time there's violence or a school, a school shooting, which this is just, you know a touchy t touchy topic. So this is no joke. I'm not joking about none of this. But uh, it's not the game itself. It's the people's mentality playing the games. If, if they play the game so much or if they uh, <clears throat> believe the game is real and, 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 their, and their brains can't handle the fact that it's a, a video game in a virtual world, how is that the game's fault? It's not. It's the person, like I said, the person's mentality playing the game. I mean, you know, I'm not saying, like, you know, people like, you know, Trying to, word, trying, to word, trying to word it very nicely. I don't want to, it's not, it's not like I told my asshole to say this. People, I mean, it's pretty much if if you, if you go into the game thinking, you know, I'm, I'm going to learn how to rob a bank or whatever, then yeah, you're, it's going to be stuck in your head, you know. It's going to be pretty much if everyone that play, plays a game that, that thinks that way is punishing people. It's, it's not fair for all of us that want to play f for fun. It's a video game, it's a virtual, virtual life that we don't have to live. So we can do, you know, different stuff. <clears throat> you know, just to see what happens. I mean, you know, I, I can say if one, I like Grand Theft Auto V and all the other games that I've kept people, but they won't do in real life? Hell no. I like freedom. I like having things. So, I, I just get tired of, let's say, it, it's been a while since so I've heard, but I just had to address it. Yes. Yeah, it, uh, actually a friend of mine, a friend of mine suggested it to me, so. I thought I'd mention it. But yeah, it's definitely not the video game's fault or the developer's fault that they make the game. It's people playing it. And I, like I said, I get so, so tired of hearing about it. Oh, well, it's violence in video games causing violence in real life. No. No, no. If you let... Prime example. Say you have uh, like a four-year-old kid that wants to play a game. Four or five. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure whenever they start playing video games. And they want to play Grand Theft Auto V. You tell them no. Just because Susie down the road has it doesn't mean your kid needs it. I mean, I'm not, I'm not saying if you let that, if you, if you, if you, if your four year or five year kids play it now, I'm not saying you're a bad person. But as long as you teach them what's right and wrong from the head, from the get go. Because if not, then shit will go astray and shit will happen. So, I, other than that, I don't really have much to say about it. It's just. You have, you have, you have, you have Grand Theft Auto V, you have, um, that's probably the, the main one that comes to mind. I can't think of anything else that, that's quite that bad. I don't know, I mean, 
I know there is. Like Saints Row is freaking absurd. I know. I, I love that game though. It's a more adult. That one is a more adult themed, for as fun wise. Uh, I won't get into details about it because if you have not played it or heard about it, you, that's probably a good thing. I think the game is hilarious. It's fun. It's uh, it's overall a good time. It's no. It's it's not like we have to go to five. I don't think, in my, in my opinion, it's a lot more down, dumbed down. As far as murder and, you know, killing people. I think. I haven't played it, I haven't played it for a little bit, so. I know four is about, you're in a virtual world, but three, three and back, I forgot. But Grand Theft Auto Five is the one that always attack first. Which is utter crap, because let's, let's just say, here's another example. About to end about it, let's talk, let's talk something else. Say I'm, I'm a movie, you know, kid down, or, uh, kid downs murder, like say Demolition Man, or Demolition Man, or like pretty much any, any horror movie, any movie that killed him. You know, what, why don't the movies being shot at? As far as, you know, for far as, far as violence movies. I mean, I think they have, but I don't, pretty much every time there's violence in real life, they play play video games, not movies. Why? Movies are almost worse than, than video games. I mean, it's People need to relax. I know this has been mentioned in a while, but I just want to give my two cents in the situation because I have an opinion like everybody else. But yeah, this is. I just had had a video. It just has some, some good topics. Hopefully, hopefully, if you guys disagreed or, 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 or agreed with me, just you know, leave it down below. Well, liking the video, disliking it, whatever. You know, everyone has an opinion. You know. I mean, I, you know, I don't want to expect everyone to be liked by everybody. I mean, you know, I'd be a perfect world, and I'm still a pretty small channel, so, yeah. And even then, if, if, if everyone just liked my stuff, then I wouldn't, you know, I would keep doing the same shit, and then, well, you know, I wouldn't know what to fix or what to have to talk about. Now, my point of views are my point of views, so, they with a grain of salt, this came from me, my opinion. So... I think you guys have it. I want to end the vlog here. I said I do get off early. I do get off early now. I do. I do not work a different schedule. So whenever I get home, it's probably about like 8 p.m. my time, something like that. I want to see if the open skills back on the stream, which will be on Twitch, and uh, all that fun stuff. Because I think the first, first or last time we did it, we had four people. Watch, no, we had four people watching. So. Yeah, to me that's a lot. I'm still learn I'm still growing. And for just, just for joining Twitch, that's three people that were good. That's good for me, so. I'm gonna end it here. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next vlog and hopefully see you in the, in this Twitch stream tonight. So see you later guys. Peace.